at that. Just look at it. Would you look at it? Oh my gosh, it's burning my mouth. Full send, here we go. Full send. And we're done. Yeah, buddy. Uh, What's up? Oh, what? Two minutes, uh, watch that. Two minutes 15 seconds. Uh, yeah. Take a picture of you. 2,000 years later. Look at this beautiful stuff. From coleslaw, love coleslaw. Potato salad? Potato salad. So here we are with a little bit of a round two. I mean, like, you know I like to eat. We're just gonna uh, try a couple different other items here. Everything looks absolutely delicious. Uh, so we got some ribs, nice barbecue pork spare ribs. It's nice and smoked. We have uh, some chicken. We have um, a hot link sausage like I just had, which I really did enjoy. It was very, very tasty. Uh, we have their spicy sauce, their traditional sauce. We also have some potato salad, mac and cheese, and some coleslaw. So we'll get this all uh, divvied out between me and Mr. Joe. If you don't know Joe, um, he has a YouTube channel. It's Jixer Joe. Also, more looks like GSXR, like the motorcycle. Joe has been with me and taking good care of me down here in Las Vegas. Um, been helping us get around, been telling us where to go. Uh, it's always great to, when you travel somewhere, to have a local to give you that real experience. So, Joe, appreciate everything, my friend. Thanks, thanks for, thanks for uh, yeah, helping with the trip. and. Let's eat some food, see what this is all about. Who gets the jalapeno? You can have it, man. I had enough, <laughs> I had enough. All right, so we kind of split our stuff up. Um, again, I think I'm gonna start with the coleslaw because my mouth is still kind of burning a little bit from that, uh, that sandwich. That being said, it's a little creamy, it looks really good, so let's see what it tastes like. Cheers. Oh, wow. So it's very crispy. It tastes very fresh, it's not soggy. There's some dill in the sauce, which is really a really nice flavor. It's just very fresh. That's hella good, actually. That's delicious. I've never had dill in coleslaw. And I think there's a little bit of mustard seed or something in there, too. What do you think, Joe? Perfect balance. It's not, not too wet, not too dry. With coleslaw, that's, yeah. that's always, you know, it's either you, you, too dry, too wet. That's yeah. perfect. Exactly. I'm liking it. I'm going to have another bite of this uh, hot leg. I really enjoyed this in the sandwich that I just ate. Um, it's very tasty. This one has the barbecue sauce on it, so let's give it a go. I love the taste of it. It's just like, this is going to sound funny, but like, obviously it tastes like a sausage, but it's a really nice, just sausage flavor. There's like a little bit of, um, I don't know, just kind of a pepperiness to it. How would you describe it? It's, it's just got a, a nice little hint of heat. So it's not spicy, but it's got a really good flavor and the seasoning's on point. Most definitely. That's a good way to put it. The seasoning is on point. Nice like cured flavor to it, nice taste. Got some, uh, got some of the chicken. Can you try chicken? Yeah, let's, let's do this. Nice smoky pink color. It's cooked. It's smoked. Oh yeah. Mm. Nice flavor. It's like a really, really nice light smoke to it. It is light, but definitely tender. Yeah. Juicy. Oh, not, not dry at all. No, it's very juicy. Very juicy. A nice light smoke flavor. I really, I like, this, the sauces here too are, are like. They're really unique. I don't know how to describe them. They're not like, again, like a super thick, thick sauce. They're not as thin as like a vinegar sauce. They're just like an, uh, just like a, I don't know how to put it, but definitely mm. some nice, what is your taste to that? How would you describe the sauce? <clears throat> so I just tried the spicy one. Oh yeah? And I'm really liking it. I gotta say it's, it's got a unique taste. It's just not, it's not a plain old barbecue sauce with heat yeah. added. No. But I kind of want to try the original now. You have the original I there. Yeah. So we got original, spicy. Definitely not plain. Nice Let's check flavor. this out. <clears throat> Very good flavor on the original. I do like the spicy though. Like spicy? Yeah, uh, what do you think? I mean, well, after, I, just, I just kind of burnt my mouth off. <laughs> so I think I'm, I might, 
for the sake of this, I might pass on the spicy, but <laughs> I'm sure it tastes great. The original one's really great, and I really like it. Um, you try the coleslaw? Or the potato salad? We didn't try that yet. Yeah, let's Did try it. You? No, I didn't. Let's try it. Let's try the potato salad. <laughs> Looks good. Hey, how's it going, guys? Mmm. Oh, yeah. First time in? Oh, no. I thought so. Nice bits of onion. It's very fresh. There's a certain flavor. I just, I can't put my, my tongue on it though. Can you get it? No, but I think there's celery in there. It yeah, tastes celery. like my mom made it. I yeah. mean, that, and that, that's a good thing because my mom is a chef. Like, yeah. It's very visibly mm. like homemade. It tastes like homemade. Mm. And it's very good. Very rich. Very creamy. Definitely a buy. Wait, let me see if I got your eyes open on this one or. Did you, did you want a picture of the rib? Yeah. I was gonna put this on their Instagram. Nice. Alright, let's try one of these ribs. Nice, juicy looking spare side ribs. Pork rib. Mm. That's a good looking rib there, Joe. I'm gonna add some of the spicy sauce. I'm loving it. Nice. I'm sticking to the original because I'm boring. Yeah, we are sold out of Alright, go I'm sorry about that. Oh, wow. Mm. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So that sauce is really popping. It's really highlighting the taste of this rib. <clears throat> the thing about the ribs, yeah. when they're done right, you take a bite and it falls off. You don't take a bite and the whole the meat comes off. Yeah. So like these are just perfectly yeah. done. No, cooked perfectly. Like it's just it's very soft and tender. Intense smokering. I mean, yeah. I wonder how many hours they smoke these babies. Mm. It's it's obviously a lot. Yeah. You know, like very. I should have showed you this before I bit it, but it's very like very soft and tender. Very tender. That's the best way to put it. But the right texture, right tender, still texture. <clears throat> Definitely tastes a smoky taste. Yeah. I'm kind of wondering what kind of wood that they smoke it with. I bet it's like a, maybe like a hickory or something. Like it's like a. Is that what the flavor you're getting? Hickory. Hickory, maybe. I can't. Maybe oak or something. Like it's really nice. It's nice and light. A nice light, smoky flavor. Yeah. Whatever this is right here, that's what they're smoking with. We got wood. We got wood. <laughs> Yeah, this is good. I dig it. Mm. Nice taste. Well, now, are, are you sure you don't want to share the jalapeno? I'm sure you can have the you sure, bro? You can have the jalapeno, Joe. Hey. Uh, I had enough spice for a while, I'll tell you that. Some people talk about needing to spice up their life. I tell you, after that Brahma bowl, my life is can be a little boring for a while. That was good, though. Really enjoyed everything. <clears throat> Oh, I should get the mac and cheese. And what was this? Yeah, I mean, you know, I, so I'm me and mac and cheese, meh. So that's all, Joe. Let's give it to Joe. And you know what? It looks like there's some cheese that's on top yeah. of it. Yeah. Hey, look at it. Let me show the. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they have this mac and cheese. It's all homemade. They make their own sauce, and they have this crumbled cheese that's on top. So because, you know, for those who believe cheese, there can never be enough cheese. It's made perfect, dude. Give it a go. Let's see what you like. You know, I'm originally from Chicago. To the north, it's Wisconsin. Oh, yeah. So you're from Cheese Country. Yeah, I have a lot of friends, family that are cheeseheads. <laughs> cheeseheads, I like that. Mm. Sweet tea still tastes great, by the way, even when I'm not dying with the Brahma Bowl. What do you think? I had it going for a second bite. Mm. Actually, the time. You know, it's good win, right? Mm. Very good, cheesy, not dry. The cheese that's on top, yeah, it's an added little touch. It's kind of like, kind of like when you put the mac and cheese in the oven, and it kind of makes that uh, top. Gives you that crunchy. Yeah, so it's, so it's giving you different dimensions of, you know, I'm digging it though. Most definitely. Dope. Yeah. Well, there you go, everybody. I think that's pretty much about everything we had here. But awesome food here. Great staff here at Sin City Smokers. Would definitely recommend. Um, num numerous awards there by the door, and like I can definitely see why. So what's also super cool is it's a great location. Like it's really close to the airport. Uh, so when you're in Las Vegas flying in and out, that's kind of how we ended up here. Um, I'm I mean, flying out here relatively shortly. So it's perfect. Stop here before the airport, then go to the airport, 
Um, I definitely feel that Brahma bowl in my stomach a little bit, so I'm hoping, really hoping, knock on wood, that this flight home is, uh, has no unexpected turbulence, let's just say. But seriously, Sin City Smokers, great food, great place. Joe, anything else you want to add? It's been really fun yeah. having you out here in Vegas. I'm, I'm glad we could come out and, you know, hang out. It's, Vegas was a blast. Yeah. Literally, literally Vegas, people don't, like, I don't think anybody understands, but Vegas is crazy. Yeah, like, everybody tells you it's crazy, but it's until you actually experience it, you don't know how crazy it is. But everybody, Vegas would recommend, Sin City Smokers would recommend. Great food, great people, and uh, I've already said all that, so until next time, stay happy, healthy, hungry. Sign us off. Deuces! Until next time, <laughs> happy <laughs> people. That's where all the flavor is at. Just look at those briskets. Beautiful. Beautiful pieces of meat. Go ahead, sir. Yeah, load them up all this for Georgia. And then they go to sleep for like 18 hours. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. That sauna bedroom. Yeah. That's where I really want to sleep, but uh, I just haven't figured out how to make it work yet. You know? Yeah. So. <laughs> Look at that smoke just rolling out of that You'd thing. you probably come out with a great tan though. Yeah, smoke rings. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. Perfect.